What's up, everybody, and welcome back to another math puzzle. In this one, the objective is as follows. Find a two-digit number such that if you place a four to the left of it and double this three-digit number, you can create a number that equals the original two-digit number times 27. So you can see here, these two blue rectangles are the placeholders for this two-digit number. And again, just to reiterate, if we put a four here, making it 400 and something, 400 in that two-digit number, you then double it, it would equal 27 times the original number. Go ahead and hit that pause button and see if you can figure it out. When you're ready, hit play, and I'll give you the explanation. Okay, so this is a really cool puzzle because there's actually two different ways that I'm going to show you how to approach it. The first way is going to be simply through logic and then we can start to get a pool of possibilities and narrow it down from there. Now, since we know we have some number that is 400 and something, we know that the minimum value this can be when you double it is 800 and the maximum, assuming the number is 499, the maximum you could get is 998. So I know that this three digit number when doubled has to be between those two numbers. I also know that if I take this two digit number and I multiply it by 27, it's got to be in that same zone. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start thinking about multiples of 27 that fall within this 800 to 998 range. So starting with 30 times 27, we get 810. And then I'm going to list out the remaining ones by adding 27. 837, 864, 891, 918, 945, 972, and 999. So again, double the three digit number has to be one of these eight options. But now I can limit it further because I know it's supposed to be double. So hey, all of the odds, if you double the number, it's always gonna be even. So all of the odd ones are out. Now I got it down to four choices. And just so it's clear, this is 27 times 30, 32, 34 and 36. So my possible answers are 30, 32, 34, and 36. If the number were 430, if we double that, we get 860, not 810. If the number were 432, we would get 864, and that's also 27 times 32. Therefore, the answer is 32. Now I'm gonna show you how to solve the same thing algebraically. It would be as follows. If I have my two digit number, which I'm gonna call X, I add 400 to it and I double this number as it kind of states up here. If I double this number, it's gonna to equal to 27 times the original two digit number. Now I've got a nice linear equation. If I solve this, I'm good to go. Distribute the two and I get 800 plus two X equals 27 X. Subtract two X from both sides and I get 800 equals 25x, divide by 25, divide by 25, x of course equals 32. I hope you enjoyed this math puzzle and if you did, please click that like button. And if you wanna see more math puzzles on the regular, make sure to click subscribe. Thank you guys so much for joining. I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.